on the old SAT, I had a section of questions that I classified as free points, okay? Free points, meaning if you just read it, you're gonna get some free points. You don't really have to do a lot of work. And this is one of those, and I'm glad to see that they're still on the new digital test because, oh, sometimes we just need to win, right? So there might be some terminology here. We don't know. A scatter plot is this. And when they ask about the line of best fit, they're not asking about those little dots. They're asking about the line. So hopefully that's kind of intuitive. Now just make sure you go to the right place, right? So X is 32. So that's here. Now go up. Where does it hit the line? Right here, kind of right above the, the two marker, right? So go over if you need to. Now where is that? It's right above two. What's right above two? 2.4. That's it. That's the whole question. We, not, we need to pay attention to the scale, right? Because it's, it's weird here. They only label every other uh, line, but the scale is still one unit per box. So that might change. There might be harder versions of this where they mess with the scale and it's kind of harder to read it correctly. But you still want to go into a question like this with that free points idea in your head. Is it's They're handing them to you. Don't screw it up. Just read it carefully, follow it as best you can, and hopefully you can just see what the right answer is. There's not really much more to this.